Behind me is Makanda, a city diverse in its history, heritage and culture. Join us as we delve into the most ancient spaces, meet the city's sweetest people and establishments and get a taste of how Makanda's citizens wine, dine and have a good time. This is Diverse City. what the cock house was before it became the guest house slash restaurant it is today. It was a private house, 1826 to about 19... 91, 1990. Yes, 1990, yeah. yeah. And then Belinda Tudge reorganised it into a guest house and restaurant. Well, in Belinda's time, we had um, Nelson Mandela stayed on two occasions and um, We've also had really Makizi and Eleanor Sazulu. We've had we've had a lot of um, interesting and important people, both business-wise and politically. And now, into the sacred space of silence and meditation. This space used to be a sculptor studio for Mark Hipper, who owned the house before us. So it was already converted into quite a nice clean space with tiles and heat and cold protection. So it's a very nice comfortable space. Mm -hmm. And we converted it into a shrine room. We run mindfulness courses and we also host Dharma teachers who are visiting South Africa, the centers in Joburg and Cape Town or running retreats. They come and give uh, courses here. I think it does have a quite a nice atmosphere, especially in the evening when we light the candles and there's incense going and people are sitting quietly. It's got a... Um, I mean, it is to promote uh, peace, I suppose. My name is Chantelle van Eysen, um, I'm the owner of Ten Cross Shop. So Ten Cross Shop is the address of the, the shop, we are Ten Cross Street. So that's where Ten Cross Shop comes from. So it's Bartholomew Street coming up from Beaufort Street and it's Cross Street going over. So we, on the corner, we sell all kinds of things that you will get in the typical home industries, uh, the fresh cakes. Um, the meals, we've got a, a big range of frozen meals, the best biltong and dry horse in town. We've got a range of fresh vegetables, cheese, dairy, and then we've got a, a selection of um, gifts, handcrafted items. We've got a lot of vendors involved at the shop, close to 100. And if you think about it, that's close to 100 families that the shop is supporting. My name is Binky Sobashe. I took interest in those beautiful buildings and that's how I got to see the Cathcart Arms and told myself one day I will buy it. It was not just a bar, it was a, a, a hotel. It's amongst the oldest in the country. It, it, it had its moments of glory. It is situated in, in what was then the, the, the CBD. It, it's got that history and bars can be, you know, a place, a place it's where people meet and talk, you know, share ideas. Actually, this place, to me, is the cultural hub of Grahamstown. Of those people who come from the township and live in town, but would prefer to drink here instead of in the township and go home. Abandu, when you come to the city of Makanda looking for a good time, looking for an accommodation with the gassy flavor, go nowhere else than to the Capcat Arms.